Welcome to a Yakuza 0 100% trophy guide video. In this video we're going to talk about the big hair in the crosshairs trophy. So this trophy is actually missable. Uh, during chapter 13 essentially you'll go through a driving section where you have to shoot enemies on various different vehicles, bikes, uh, vans, etc, cars. So the aim of this game really is to shoot in the middle of the circle. You can use heat eye to slow it down, makes it a bit easier shoot in the middle of the circle it will be a kill shot basically or a really high damage shot so that is what you're aiming for that is what you do about halfway through uh, a guy with big hair so like an afro comes along and uh, yeah tries to do you in always shoot in the middle even if it doesn't look like it's gonna hit them in the head or whatever it'll do the most damage so here he is afro jimmy no it isn't he's not him he's on the bike Afro Jim is coming though, very soon. And you just have to hit him. He sort of drives to the side of you quite fast. Um, but yeah, I think this is it now. Uh, no, not him. This one, here he is, Afro Jimmy in the green car. So I'll headshot him. And then the trophy will pop. I will leave the rest of this in just so we can talk about uh, <laughs> this section on Legendary is kind of rough, to say the least. So, shoot away. It's even worse on Kiwami 1 as well. Make sure you're headshotting people in the center. You always kind of want to go for the uh, car if you can. Because that does damage to your car. For some reason it didn't do damage to my car then, which is really weird. Uh, but yeah, so always like try and take out the explosive dudes first. Obviously get hit by a rocket there, not pleasant. If you're on legendary, this like damage you take from getting hit from those sorts of things is huge. You don't want to get hit by anything if possible before the end. Uh, but it is quite tricky, so do your best. Always hit the center. And then I think a helicopter in this one comes down and starts like trying to attack you. So with the helicopter, it's not too bad. Just take out the gun the gunner and the Explosive guy. We take out the gunner first uh, with the machine gun. And then the explosive guy will just fire off rockets. You don't need to worry too much about him. Because you can just shoot the rocket. And you can just slow it down for the rocket. But yeah, always aim for the gunner uh, as quickly as possible. A little QT here. Bam. Shoot the rocket that's coming towards you. And that'll blow it up. And then you're back to the fight with the helicopter. So yeah. The less damage you take, the better it is. It's kind of an awkward one because the, the thing's shaking around all over the show. If you do get the central hit, it does reset them on their sort of um, attack trigger. So that's why you want to aim for the center. As soon as you take out that dude, you can be less sort of aggressive on the rockets. He does start chaining rockets quite madly at one point, which is crazy. But yeah, this guy starts trying to attack you with a gun, <laughs> even though he's flying a helicopter really low. Pretty easy, that bit. In, in Kiwami 1, it's way harder. But yeah, thank you very much for watching. Take care, and peace out.